Good morning, friends. It is Tanya, Thrifty Treasures. It is Friday morning, and I am off to hit some garage sales this morning, and I am going to take you with me. Oh my goodness, some people already have their Christmas decorations in the front yard. I am actively shopping for a new Christmas tree. So, you know, Christmas decorations are a lot of work. So I definitely understand why people start decorating early, that's for sure. Ooh, we got lots of stuff here. Let's see if I can find some place to park. found another garage sale you guys I highly suggest that you guys just drive around your area because you can find a lot of sales that way that are not even advertised in the paper or in the apps and that's what I'm doing today I mean I do have some that I looked at on the apps that I'm definitely gonna hit up but these I do not think that they were in the app so it looks like they got a lot of stuff I'm gonna go check it out Oh my gosh, you guys, you are not going to believe the treasures I picked up at that last garage sale for $1.75. So as soon as I get stopped, I'm going to show you what I picked up. Okay, you guys, so I walked up and the first thing I saw was this little treasure box. And I thought, oh, that's cute. So I opened it. And look what I found inside. There's all kinds of jewelry. So it looks like I'm in a bad spot with the sun. Let me move and then I'll show you the jewelry. Okay, you guys, I still haven't had a chance to stop so I can show you all the jewelry, but I picked up even more jewelry. I'm so excited. It's total jewelry day. So um, my tip to you would be is to do not take items that you see at garage sale for face value. If they can open or if there's like a zip closure or a button, take the time to open that stuff and look in it because I just picked up um, a camera bag and it was stuffed full of jewelry. So I'm super excited. I don't know. I might have to wait till I just get back to the house to show you guys everything I got. But um, yeah, I can't wait to show you all that. And right now I am on my way to a community garage sale. So hopefully I'll find some more treasures. Okay, so um, squirrel. <laughs> I saw an estate sale sign. So I thought I'd go check that out. And then I'm going to go find this community garage sale. Okay, I know I haven't showed you guys my um, finds yet. So I just got here to Hobby Lobby and I am shopping for a new Christmas tree this year because ours finally bit the dust last year. So um, right now Hobby Lobby has their Christmas trees 50% off. So I'm gonna run inside and check it out. But I was just getting ready to get out of the car and I was thinking, oh my gosh, if somebody walked past my car right now, they would think I was a total hoarder, <laughs> which I am. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to go inside and um, see if I can't find me a Christmas tree. So I think this is the one. It's really pretty. Okay, so I did not buy that tree that I said I was going to get. I took the pictures and there's a chance I might go back and get that one, but I want to check first at Walmart and Lowe's see if they have anything uh, that's a little bit cheaper that I like. If not, I'm going to come back and get that tree. So, off to Walmart and Lowe's real quick. I've literally been shopping since 8 o'clock this morning. <laughs> but some days, you know, you just have to get everything down in one day. Plus, it was garage sales, and I really enjoy garage selling on Fridays because I can really go wherever I want. Lots of times on Saturdays, 
I will have Madeline with me or I'll be in a hurry to get back home um, if the kids stay home so I don't like to go too far so Fridays are always a big shopping day for me if, especially if I'm out for it so so off to Walmart we go and I'm so glad I listened to my husband this morning because I was like I think I should wear boots and he was like no it's gonna warm up today and did it ever <laughs> so I'm uh, glad I am wearing my sandals and no boots because it's definitely warmed up an interesting one. It's a snowman Christmas tree. Pretty cute. Okay, so I just walked out of Walmart. I ended up getting the $39 tree. It's a six and a half uh, foot uh, Madison pre-lit multicolor Christmas tree for $39. I know it's not as glamorous as the other ones I was looking at, but $200 is a lot to spend on a Christmas tree and I just could not bring myself to doing it. So, I mean, once I get home and I set it up and say, I'm not crazy about it, I can always return it. So, um, I think I made a good choice and I think I saved a lot of money too. I think I've decided that I'm just going to do a separate haul video once I get home. So, if you guys want to see all the goods I got, uh, you're going to have to stay tuned and uh, I'm probably just going to go live and show everything that I got real quick. So that's probably going to upload before this ride along video. So um, if you're seeing this video now, go back and look. It'll probably be the video that was published before this one to see my haul video. All right. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. I appreciate it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video and share it with your friends. And we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.